Hello, this is Leah from Imagine DIY and I just wanted to show you today how we made this really beautiful glitter laser cut pocket invitation. Um, as you can see, it's got this amazing silver glitter finish. It's also available in a rose gold or a gold glitter. And um, we've added a silver glitter card and also a nude pink glitter card just to give it that extra pop. All the written instructions and the templates are available on our website, Imagine DIY. So you can visit, you can buy everything you need to make this, um, and you can also just download the templates, fill it in, print it, and cut it down to size using a scissors or your own paper trimmer. A paper trimmer would be better, actually. So let's see how we did it. So all the sizes are on the website as well, so you can see the sizes, everything needs to be cut to. So we're starting, we recommend the um, high tack tape for glitter card because it just sticks really well and other things stick to the glitter. The glitter can sometimes be a bit of a problem to stick to, but this works amazingly. It's the best thing we've ever found. So we're just on the larger panel, the invitation panel, we're just going around the outside edges and just stick in. Um, tape around the edges. This is a little time consuming but it's worth it. Try not to get it too bunched up as you do it because sometimes that can show through. There you go. And we're then just sticking that to the central panel of the invitation. Try to make sure your borders are even because that adds a much more professional finish. You don't want one funky looking invitations. So we're then doing the same with a slightly smaller nude pink glitter card. Just going around the outside edges quickly. Uh, you don't need to be too precise about this. These invitations they're so great because you really don't have to do a lot to them to make them look good. You can add some ribbon to the outside edges, you can add a small embellishment, but I think they're so beautiful. I think they work just so well if you just frame um, the printed section well. So pattern paper and, and pattern card works well with it, but I, I really personally like the glitter against the glitter. It's, it's just enough. And the pattern is beautiful too, if you can see on the pocket. Right, so we've nearly, nearly finished this section. You will get through quite a bit of tape doing this. Probably about a metre and a half per invitation. So if you calculate that in when you're buying your supplies. Yeah, we've just stuck our invitation panel on there. Look, there you go. So we're going to do the same for the information sheet. We're just sticking that to the card. I'm just, I'm not even going to finish this. I'm just going to show you how it's done. You know you have to go all around the edges like we've just done. There, that goes in the pocket. Again, with the additional information sheet, you want to go around the outside edge and across the middle again with a double sided tape. Make sure your borders are even as you're sticking it into place. Pop that in the pocket. Your RSVP just goes in the pocket. If you wanted to, you could just cut a small strip of glitter paper or card to go across the top. I've done that here, look. And then your invitation is done. Look how stunning that is. Your guests are going to love them. So why don't you give it a go? Super, super easy and super, super effective. So visit Imagine DIY and you can get all the products you need to make.